Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Marina Christensen and I make videos about sustainable living, fitness, food and health in general. And in today's video I want to share with you my current favorite food products and makeup, skincare and household items I use a lot at the moment. And if you would like to see more videos of that kind, make sure to click the like and subscribe button down below. Hit the little bell so that you always get notified when I upload a new video. And one more thing I want to mention is that this video is not sponsored by any of these brands. These are just things I personally really like to use and anyways I will leave the links to the websites and everything down below so that you can check it out yourself and maybe fall in love with them like I did. And we'll start with the first section. So I have one is the food section and the other section is like the makeup, skincare and household items. I have eight items in, in total. I mean I have nine items in total not eight I have nine and we'll start with the makeup so for makeup I have two things I really like at the moment one is this matte pro ink non-transfer lipstick from Catrice in the color I choose passion or 60 I choose passion I'm wearing it at the moment I really like it because it is matte and I prefer matte over shiny. It holds really good and what I like about Catrice is the smell of their cosmetics. They have a special smell to them which is nice. So in general I really don't like any kind of stupid smells and Catrice is absolutely fine for me and I love their lip items their lip products in general this one is the one i'm using most of the time currently over my lip liner or with the lip liner i like it because the color is very close to my actual lip color and i like it when it's natural and neutral and not too much. I do love red lips and black lips but I do not wear it because I'm not comfortable with my lips and therefore I'm always having neutral lips and this one is really great and it doesn't feel like your lips do dry out at least not to me. Next makeup item is the natural refill compact powder and cold beige 01 from Benacos Natural Beauty Cosmetics. I do not only use it for like as a powder, um, I only use it on spots. Like for example, I have a red spot somewhere. I use my general uh, foundation, which is super little. I mean, you can see my freckles underneath the foundation and yeah, and my freckles are very faint and when you can see them under the foundation or that really means I do not wear a lot of foundation and when I have a red spot, I use this and put it on top and the red spot is gone. Please Lulu, I'm recording a video. Would you mind to stay yeah mostly i'm using this as an eyeshadow or eyeshadow base as i'm not using a lot of colors on my eyes today i have a little bit of a reddish tone also from benacos uh, on top but in general i only have the base color and then the little wing i do what I love about this is it's a refill for a palette and you can you open it and something cute written 
and then there is the palette inside. I first I'm using this side. So it's just a cardboard and this metal container where the powder is inside. They have palettes. I do not have a palette because I don't like palettes. They have a limited amount you can fill inside and I wouldn't get it filled the way I would like it to. I have three colors of these. This one, a brownish one and this reddish one and the color and the palette wouldn't be full. Um, anyways, I think refillers and palettes in general for refillers are amazing because you can choose the colors yourself and you have a lot less waste. I can't recommend these absolutely. They are nice pigmented but they're not like in your face. Great. Let's go to skincare. There I also have two products I want to share with you. One is a rosehip oil. Rosehip oil is so nourishing. It's a great skin treatment. I personally love using it. I use it every three days for bedtime as a treatment. Not every day. It has a yellowishy color. And when you put it on your skin, it's like orangey yellowish. Don't be afraid, this is the color of rosehip oil. It has a special smell to it. Some people will like it, some will not like it. I got used to it, but I wasn't liking it at the, at the beginning. I still don't like it, but I got used to it and that's absolutely fine. This one is organic, I always use organic. It's from... Um, Yes style so I don't have a real brand I use because I always choose the one that's available and and when it's organic I'm fine with it the second skincare product is a body butter from LOV I hope I pronounce it right and I have the fragrance lavender and I like lavender, 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 lavender. Um, it has a very soft smell to it, so the fragrance is not too much, and it's nice and soft, as I said. And I was looking for something for my skin, for my body, because in general, all of these body oils and body butters do tend to sit on your skin and do not soak in and this one does it does not leave a film on your skin it nourishes and it makes it soft and my skin improved so much and a great thing of this is only six ingredients natural ingredients you can pronounce if you know somehow it's handmade in California and the owner Kelly is such a nice person and thank you so much for introducing me to your brand it's amazing now to the household item which is a baking item a baking pan a Madeleine pan so they are mowing Please ignore it when you can hear the sound on the camera, on your, on the video. Madeleines, 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 when you say it in French. I love baking it because like it's not an original um, Madeleines recipe because they contain a lot of butter and eggs and I'm vegan as you know. But just baking things in this mold is amazing because they have bite size and I do not have to cut a cake or something. I just take some and 
that's it and this mold is from Berkman 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 is a German brand they have very high quality molds and yes this Madeleine mold is like my number one mold at the moment and it's easy to store because you can put them all over each other and um, this is why I had to include this into my video into this video as I'm using it so much and from a baking mold to the food items let's start with Moringer powder this one is from Poya and I have a whole video on all Poya products on my channel so here you can check it out here and I'm using this almost every day in my smoothies I love using it in pesto, dressings, dips sprinkle some, sprinkle it a little bit on the salad to have more nutrients as it is so health and health benefits as it has so many health benefits and I also include it in raw treats and just everything it's it's my current love yeah. they are mowing every day I feel like every day the whole day and okay I will keep this whole food section a little compact I will make it a little quicker next up we have sprouted raw sprouted oats from Govinda I always put it in a jar because it's easier so these are the oats and they are thick cutted which I absolutely love because the taste is like stronger and a little more woody like And currently I really enjoy having muesli they also make me feel really good when I have it in the afternoon with my fruit so I have a fruit muesli I can't concentrate I can't figure out a good sentence I can't make up a good sentence because this is annoying all that mowing it can take a while so I have to I just have to do this video now and it's so annoying and I'm so sorry really it's and I can't remember where I was I was somewhere with the oats raw sprouted oats have even more nutrients than the ones you buy in general they also have a little different taste they have a little bit of this when you sprout things they have a slightly bitter and sour flavor to them like this this particular sprout flavor and they also have a little bit of this sprout flavor sprout flavor to them which I personally absolutely enjoy and now to the two last items the two last food products one is spirulina the products from Sunday Natural are such high quality and since I use them I use them now for a very long time for years and every single product I used from them I was stunned and I love this brand I really love it this spirulina is from Hawaii and you probably already know that it has so many health benefits so many nutrients minerals vitamins um, it contains natural b12 and the color of this one is a greenish bluish color um, depending on with what you're mixing it it has a more turquoise color or a more darker greenish color and it has a really nice and soft flavor to it it's not as um, dominant as the 
lower quality spirulinas it matches to a lot of things anyways you taste it you taste that there's spirulina spirulina inside but I like the spirulina taste the spirulina flavor and I personally now would always choose the spirulina from Sunday over any other spirulina I tried until now and one more product from Sunday is this tea purple Kenya Mount Kenya purple tea it's a black tea and it really is the best black tea I've ever tried so far it is so elegant and round and it has a full mouth flavor and it feels so good and the taste is different than all of the others and you cannot compare it to the general black teas you know from your health store or any brand you used before the word that came straight to my mind when I first uh, drank this tea was exquisite I do not exaggerate when I say it's the best black tea you need only a little of it and you can pour water over it multiple times each time the flavor is a little different it faints but it's not a faint of that it tastes less it tastes different less if that makes sense probably not when you try it you know what I mean um, but it's exquisite it's so round and delicious and I also enjoy it with a little bit of plant milk or just plain and I love plain things and cold warm lukewarm iced it's perfect for everything really the best black tea ever and that's everything that were all these were all nine items all nine products I want to talk about and I'm so happy that I finally can say I did it thank you so much for watching thank you for taking the pain of uh, this annoying noise I hope it's not as loud on the video as it was inside here and I hope we will see you next time again until then have a great day a great afternoon i don't know wherever you are on this planet and goodbye <laughs> like the the color when you when they um, prepare an operation and there is this brownish yellowish pinkish whatsoever orangish color i don't know what it actually is but it looks like that so